and it'll look for other cached information on your host. Like, I don't know, your Discord account, Discord token, Steam token, Telegram info, whatever. Of course, it'll also pull out cookies that are saved and kept track of by your browser as you log into websites. And on top of that, it'll even look for other information like your username on your computer, your computer's name, host name, IP address, the amount of RAM that you have, your operating system, maybe even your screen size. So let me show you an example of some of those logs from InfoStealer Malware. And let me say, this is fake data. It's anonymized, and with that, we can go ahead and show it. But if I extract all this out and then open it up in a text editor, take a look. If I expand out that folder for the Stealer log, you can see passwords.txt. And I'll zoom in a little bit here. Again, this is all fake data. And this is all coming from the Redline variant of InfoStealer Malware. Redline InfoStealer used to be everywhere.